Hello, welcome back to Retro Break. I hope you're all doing okay wherever you are out there in the world. I know everything's gone a little bit crazy at the minute, but I'm really glad that I made it back home. The flights on the way back from Japan were a little troublesome and actually took us a lot longer than we were expecting to be able to get back. But I am back and I'm in good health, so I'm gonna be spending the next few weeks editing all my videos from Japan. So in this first video, I'm going to show you the new Nintendo store in Shibuya Parko. It's absolutely an amazing store and I picked up loads of stuff while I was there. So I'm going to do a tour of the shop and then I'm going to show you all the amazing things that I picked up while I was there. The shop was split up into different sections for Mario, Zelda, Splatoon and Kirby. In this video, I'm going to show you all of the different areas and actually outside of this shop as well on the same floor there was a separate Capcom store as well that sold things from Monster Hunter, Mega Man and Resident Evil. And behind the Nintendo store as well there was also a brand new Pokemon Center. And this one was quite interesting because it sold some Mario and Pokemon crossover items as well. And I'll show some video from that Pokemon Center at the end of this tour. Thank you so much for watching, I really hope you enjoy it. And let me know down in the comments if you see anything that you like.
So there we go, I really hope you enjoyed that tour of the Nintendo store in Shibuya. Now let's take a look at all the stuff that I've got here. So the first thing here are these Yoshi biscuits in this little tin. I haven't actually opened them yet, but I will do later on and I'll show you a picture or some videos from them. Uh, that's from somewhere else. There's a few other things in this bag as well that aren't from the Nintendo store. What else do we have? We have some Kirby stickers. I was really excited to see all the Kirby stuff there. So there's this nice Pop Star sticker here. Um, these two were from somewhere else. And there's another Kirby sticker there. That one says Milky Way and Poo 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 something, which seems to be Kirby's new sort of theme. And we've also got an Animal Crossing Museum sticker. And a uh, steampunk style Kirby which I presume is from Planet Robobot so they're always really cool to get. We also got some Nintendo official pin badges which is really cool. So there we've got Link, we've got some Animal Crossing characters, Isabel and the main girl and we've got Splatoon and we've got Mario on the end. I also picked up a Kirby Waddle Dee pen from the Kirby section. And of course, I had to get myself a Kirby as well. There's a Kirby on a star. And to go with Kirby, there's also a Meta Knight in there as well. And another Kirby. This one's a little painter Kirby. And I'm not really sure what this is. This is something that my girlfriend put in there. It's like some sort of Yoshi egg post-it note things. And then we've got this, which is like little plastic keyring things. So I got the Mario one. These were all kind of a lucky dip thing, so you could win one of any of these characters on there. But I managed to get the Mario one, which I'm pretty happy about. So let's take that out. Oh, there we go. So it's got the chain that you're going to put on there separately. But there's Mario himself, so that's really cool. I also got this really nice Yoshi's Crafted World um, sketchbook. So let's open this up. There you go, you can see it a bit better now. So this really nice Yoshi's Crafted World sketchbook. And it's just blank pages inside, but it's got a nice Yoshi cover on the front. And a Mario notebook as well. This one's got some really nice artwork from all the different Mario games. Uh, so New Super Mario Bros, Mario 3, um, Mario 3D World, and then at the bottom of the pages, if it will focus, not sure if it has, but there's also like little Mario icons. What else is here? Oh, this Kirby's really cool. This one is like a plushy Kirby on a star, but it's actually got wheels at the back. It's actually a pullback, so you can sort of... I'll show you in a bit, but you can sort of put it on the floor and it'll just fly across like that, which I thought was really nice. There's also another key ring. This is the Tanuki Mario one from Mario 3 and other games. And there's these little rubbers that you could fill up in this little pot here. Another Kirby. This is Ice Kirby. Uh, that's what the Tanuki Mario came in. I almost forgot to show these off as well, but there was two t-shirts that I picked up as well. There's this Mario one with all these different item icons on, which looks really nice. And the other one I got is the Mewtwo and Nintendo, or Mewtwo and Mario crossover t-shirt. So if you saw my last video, you saw me wearing this one, but here's a nice close-up of it. And you can see the Mario sprites in there that build up to make the Mewtwo uh, pattern. And in the Pokemon Center it was the other way around. It was Mario characters with uh, Pokemon sprites on the inside as well. But unfortunately, I thought I'd got footage from that, but I actually didn't. So there we go. That's all the stuff.
And that's it, that's all the stuff that I got from the Nintendo store. So I really hope you enjoyed having a look around the store. Hopefully once all this coronavirus stuff is out of the way, if any of you are thinking of going back to Japan, you'll go and check it out. It's in the Shibuya Parko building. I'll put a link in the description so you can see exactly how to get to it. And I would definitely recommend visiting if you're ever in Japan. So thank you all so much for watching. I've got loads more Japan videos coming soon. See you next week for the next one. Goodbye.